Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. So over the next 10 days I am going to be going on a bit of a journey and this is with collagen. So for the next 10 days I'm going to be taking some collagen supplements and seeing how they react with my body, how they react skin, nails, hair, all that good stuff. So if, just in case anyone didn't know, collagen is actually a protein which your body produces naturally. Uh, it can also be found in like animals, so cows and also fish. So for example, if you tend to eat more meat and fish, then your body will produce more natural collagen. Uh, it can also be found in vegan diets uh, as well, but mostly from animal products. Uh, dairy as well produces collagen. However, I personally don't eat any red meat or fish, so my body probably doesn't produce as much as others would. So the protein from collagen is actually quite a, an important function in your body and I have really been reading up on this. So not only is it good for your skin, uh, your elasticity and also like regeneration of skin cells, but it also helps to form ligaments, muscles, tendons, all the things that we have in our bodies. So the collagen supplements that I am going to be trying this over the next 10 days are from Regenicol and these are marine collagen supplements so they come from fish. I actually received an email from the lovely Emma at Regenicol and she offered some information. She told me all about their products and would I be interested in trying some and I had actually been looking into this before she emailed. It was quite spooky actually. Uh, but anyway, I uh, agreed to try and they have very kindly sent over this pack of the supplements for me to try. Uh, not an ad, but the products were gifted. So thank you so much Regenical for that. So in the pack it comes with all the little info cards of all the different supplements that are in here and what they do and how they work and all the good information so I have certainly been reading up on these and actually it's been quite interesting um, I didn't know but after the age of 25 uh, we break down more collagen than what we actually produce which I thought was interesting I am over 25 now I'm 26 I'll be 27 this year and so I thought that was interesting another thing to note is that Obviously aging is natural and everybody ages, which is fine, but uh, the collagen in your body helps, you know, to prevent the, the wrinkles and, you know, the little crow's feet and all the things. So with the collagen, the elasticity helps, you know, to kind of keep your skin looking quite youthful. Uh, I didn't know that, so that was interesting. It also helps to balance out skin tone. Now, this is something that I do personally struggle with. You can probably see uh, I do have, I'm quite prone to blemishes. I put it down to just natural rosy cheeks, I don't know, but I think my skin is quite prone to blemishes. Let me just zoom in a little bit so you can see properly. You can see here my skin tone is not very even, it is quite red, quite blemishy all the way around up into my forehead and then in my forehead I do tend to get quite uh, enlarged pores, you can see these little bumps here so so I am quite interested to see if the collagen will even that out and if there's going to be any difference. Uh, I don't know if 10 days is enough to see a huge difference. Uh, it does say on the little info packet that um, well, you can see a difference over the course of eight weeks but I don't know. We'll try it out and we will see. So in the little packet they sent over there were 10 of the Regenical Collagen Restoration Packs. Um, again marine collagen so I don't know if you'll be able to see the writing on the foil paper but this is what it looks like and inside is obviously the powder so there's 10 of those on the first five days you just add these 
into water. Well, it says in the first four days you have to add them to water and then on the fifth day you can go crazy and add it to whatever you want. Basically you can add it to like a curry mix, a pancake mix, any kind of food really, soup or whatever you want. Uh, I think honestly I am probably just going to add them to the water but then for the last five days there are also different ones. There is a daily digest, there's a hot chocolate mix which I think that one might be quite good. Um, there is also a daily detox and there is a malted milk and with these ones they all have their little info cards like I showed you so it tells you on the back exactly how to do it so this is the daily digest one just for reference so it says it's best made up into an ice cold glass of water prepare to take 200 mils of ice cold water add 10,000 milligram sachet of regenical marine collagen stir vigorously so on the last days you add one of these to your water with one of these so I think that might be quite interesting to see so I'm gonna go ahead now and add the sachet to this little bottle of water this is just good old-fashioned tap water <laughs> nothing fancy okay There's not a smell or anything from it, so um, here we go. Okay, you can see I've added that and you can see the powder is all just kind of sinking down here into the water. Now it does say to let it settle for a minute and then stir vigorously. So that is what I'm going to do. So far it's looking kind of cloudy. I don't know if that's picking up well on camera. Um, this might be quite interesting to see how this tastes, if there is a taste from it or not. I have tried other sashes similar to this. I actually had the Ardbourne ones and there was a, like a slight taste from them. It was nice. It was like a sort of strawberry flavour. Um, but because this is marine collagen I hope there's not going to be like a fishy taste from it. Okay, it is still looking quite cloudy. I think what I'm going to do is put the lid on and then just give it a bit of a shake as well just to be safe. Okay guys that has been about maybe two minutes and as you can see it has gone completely clear again. So that's interesting how it just kind of dispersed, I don't know, is that the right word? Dispersed? I don't know. It just sort of dissolved. So let's try it and see. Mm. There is a slight taste but not anything disgusting, it doesn't taste fishy. Yeah, very, very, very slight, slight taste but nothing dramatic I guess if you were adding it in uh, coffee or tea that's what said you can add it to hot drinks as well or hot chocolate um I guess you wouldn't be able to taste it at all maybe if you also added like a, a squash like an orange or black currant you know diluting juice to this maybe there would be no taste I don't know maybe we'll try that tomorrow and see what we think but for now thumbs up and I'm going to keep you posted over the next 10 days and we'll just see how it goes. Hello everyone, it is day three taking Regenicol uh, collagen supplements. So far so good. Um, the other day I told you that I had mixed it in just with water and there was a very slight taste. Today I have mixed it with a little bit of squash or diluting juice if you're from Scotland. I haven't tried it yet so let's see. That's much better, much, much better. You can't really taste it now. I know that it was a particularly bad taste, but now it just tastes like a drink, just like a juice that you would normally have. Uh, I'm in the car, I'm with my sister. We are going to get some passport photos taken. Uh, so that's what's up. But yes, uh, 
I think it tastes better mixed with a drink. But we'll see in a couple of days. I might do a mix with a coffee, see how that goes. But I'll keep you posted. Hi guys, it's day six of taking the Regenical supplements. So for the last five days, I've been taking just the marine collagen on its own. But as I said in the start of this video, on you do that for five days and then on the 6th, 7th, 8th and 9th day you take one of the supplements. So today I am going to be taking the Daily Detox also with the Marine Collagen. Uh, it said on the little info sheet that comes with it, best made up into an ice glass cold of water. An ice cold glass of water. And so that's what I've got here. Not a glass, a bottle. And I'm just going to go ahead and add these in here. I did also add a little bit of the black currant squash again, just to minimise the taste. Again, not that it was a particularly bad taste, there just was a slight taste from it. So that is the collagen in. Now add in the Daily Detox Supplement. Oh, it's... The other powder was white, this one is kind of green in colour. Okay, that's not, uh, you know, dissolving so fast. Let me show you. So that's the colour. I'm going to now stir this in. It says stir vigorously for one minute, so I'm going to do that now. It smells good. It smells like... I'm not sure. Uh, it smells like green tea, kind of. It smells good. The colour definitely has changed. It is now this green shade, I guess that makes sense. The powder was green. But I wonder, will it dissolve the same as just the normal collagen or not? I guess we'll find out. Okay, it has been stirred vigorously for one minute. Now I'm going to also give it a shake just in case any has settled at the bottom here. It's quite hard to tell. It is uh, very thick. You can, I don't know if you can see. It's not see-through anymore. You can definitely see the green colour. But let's just... Okay, just going to let that settle for a few seconds and then we'll do the taste test. It, it does smell good. I'm hoping it's going to also taste good. In the meantime, whilst I'm letting that settle, I'll just give you another close-up here of my skin. Um, I don't know if it's just me or not. I mean, I do certainly still have a few blemishes here and there, but my skin does look a bit clearer, minus a couple of breakouts. But um, I think those might be hormonal. Anyway, uh, around here where I normally have sort of all of my blemishes, it, my skin is looking much cleaner, which honestly I didn't think it would after having only been doing this for five days. I thought it maybe would have taken a lot longer than that. I haven't been doing any sort of vigorous skincare routine or anything, just my usual serum and moisturiser, which I normally do, but I mean, definitely a difference than when I showed you on the first day. So that's interesting to note. Okay, let's try this. I hope it's going to be nice. <laughs> That tastes really good. Mm. It's actually really sweet. Uh, mm, that is definitely interesting. I really honestly thought that was going to be disgusting, but it, it's actually really nice. It's really sweet. It tastes kind of like, uh, like a matcha ice cream tea. I'm just looking at the ingredients here and it, so it has wheatgrass, alfalfa, I've no glasses on. Spirulina ash awaga. I'm sorry, I'm probably butchering all of this. Camel camel, hyaluronic acid, spinach, and natural flavour. Vitamin and mineral blend. So I'm not sure what the flavour is. I don't think it's spinach. I don't think spinach tastes that sweet. <laughs> Definitely not. But mm, I really, I really like that. It's really nice. So here we are, day six. I'll come back and check in tomorrow, day seven, eight and nine. 
and I'll let you know how I get on with the rest of the, the little sashes and we'll see how good they are but so far I'm gonna go ahead and give this program a thumbs up let's see how I feel in the next few days hey guys it's Friday and that means it is day seven of my regenical journey so today I'm doing as normal the marine collagen but also the daily digest so yesterday I did the daily detox and it was really nice it was really sweet so I'm hoping this one will also be the same uh, I have high hopes I think it probably will be I mean why wouldn't it be the other one was great so I think this one will be too okay marine collagen going in and now daily digest going in which is also green not as green as the, the daily detox but still green oh this smells mmm it smells fruity stirring vigorously for one minute as always and also just give it a wee shake again you probably don't need to do this but I just like to be safe make sure it's all mixed in okay so this one looks more orangey than green now that it's mixed in I don't know we'll see give that a minute to settle so on the little info card that it comes with it says best made up into an ice cold glass of water so I've done that and, and the ingredients say that it's, again, I'm probably going to butcher some of these names, but it's moringa, paisleum husk, banana, ginger, turmeric, hyaluronic acid, mango, natural flavour, and then it also has vitamin and mineral blend, vitamin C, vitamin D. So probably what the fruit smell I was smelling is probably the mango, I think. Uh, it, it smells really good. Here goes, let's give it a little try. Not as strong as the Daily Detox was, that was like really quite strong, like it was good but it was quite sweet and this one is not so sweet but um, you, you can taste like the fruity sort of taste from it. Mm. Now the funny thing is, after reading this, I know but you can taste the ginger would say it tastes more gingery than it does mangoey, which is interesting because it smelled really fruity, like really, really fruity going in. But now that it's in there, it does taste more like ginger, which is odd, but it's good. I mean, if you like ginger, or if not, then too bad, but I like it. So, so I'm going to get on with my day, finish this, and then tomorrow I'm going to be trying the malted milk, which it says you can make up in coffee. So that might be interesting i've not tried these yet with hot drinks so stay tuned for that hey everyone it is day eight of the regenical journey so today i'm doing the malted milk it says on the little info card here you can make up with water however we believe they taste best with your favorite milk be that almond soy lacto free semi skimmed or a whole filled fat uh, i am going to actually make this up in a coffee just because the milk that I personally like to use is the Alpro coconut milk and honestly I don't think that's going to taste very good at hot. I've got my little mason jar here with the coffee and milk already in and I'm just going to add the boiling water to make this into coffee. Okay and now as always add in the marine collagen first. And then add in the malted milk sachet. Let's stir vigorously for one minute and then let's see how this tastes. Okay, here it is. I'm a very cute Christmas cup. I'm aware it's no longer Christmas, but just go with it. Uh, here we go, I guess. Okay, it definitely tastes molly. Absolutely. Uh, you can taste the coffee coming through, but yeah, you can definitely taste the, the maltiness, if that's the word. Mm. I don't know if this one's my favourite, guys. I mean, it's okay. It's not like terribly disgusting and undrinkable or anything, but 
just for my personal taste that I'm not sure that I really like this one that much. I'll keep going with it and see how I feel but yeah definitely not my favourite. I think I absolutely much preferred the Daily Detox and the Daily Digest but I will drink it and I'll see. <laughs> I'll come back in a little while once I've finished this and check in with you and let you know how it was but just for my own personal taste uh, this definitely isn't my favourite but if you do like that sort of multi taste then you know this one might be for you. Hey guys so I finished the drink I'm, I'm going to be totally honest it wasn't my favourite thing ever I think um, it did taste better as it cooled down however just not my personal favourite taste I'm sure other people probably would love that uh, but for me I wasn't very keen to be honest um, but that's fine everybody has a different taste everybody has different likes and dislikes so I'm going to keep going. Tomorrow I'm going to try the hot chocolate powder and see how that goes. Uh, I'm sure that'll be nicer because who doesn't love hot chocolate? Anyway, going to get on with some editing now and I'll come back tomorrow and do the final taste test. Hello, it is day nine of taking the Regenicol supplements. Today is hot chocolate day. So I have just hit up my milk. For this I'm using the Alpro chocolate milk, which personally I just think tastes better for hot chocolate. And I'm going to go ahead and add the sachets. So first going in the marine collagen and now adding the hot chocolate powder. As always it says to stir vigorously, so here goes. Okay, as you can see, the steam coming out of this, it is very hot, so I'm just going to let it cool for a minute before I try it. Okay, it's still a little bit hot, but I think it's cooled down enough to taste. Mmm. Good. It just tastes like normal hot chocolate, just like a regular hot chocolate that you would make as normal. So definite thumbs up for that one, uh, possibly my favourite of all actually. <laughs> really nice, really nice, 10 out of 10. Hey everyone, it is day 10, the last day of taking the Regenical supplements and honestly I'm quite sad about this actually, that it's the last day. I've really enjoyed this programme. Um, I have seen a little bit of a difference in my skin, which I didn't think I would have, honestly, um, in the 10 days. I, I really didn't think that that was going to be long enough to notice any real difference, but I have seen a little bit of a difference, um, minus a couple of breakouts that I've been having, but my skin definitely does look cleaner. Granted, I still do have the, the blemishes here. I don't know Honestly, if that is just rosy cheeks or if, you know, taking these for longer will maybe sort that out or not. But certainly my forehead and my the rest of my skin has been a lot cleaner. So thankful for that. I've just added my last sachet now into this water. But overall, I'm actually really, really pleased at how this program went. Uh, minus the malted milk. That wasn't my favourite, I must say, it wasn't. But the rest were all really nice, um, especially the Daily Detox and the Daily Digest. They were really, really tasty. Uh, I was, again, very surprised because usually these things are not very nice, but they were delicious. So I absolutely will be doing a repurchase on these. Like I said in the start of this video, these products were very kindly gifted to me by the lovely Emma from Regenicol. Um, not an ad but they were gifted and I will be doing a repurchase because I think they are just fab. So on the Regenicol website they do have multiple different options. They have one that's like a subscription which comes to you every month or you can just do like a trial for a couple of weeks or whatever. Like they have loads of different options. So if you guys do want to try these after watching this video, then they have also very kindly given me a code for you guys, which is 
Nicola 10. And that will get you 10% off your total cart. Um, which honestly I think is very generous of them. Giving me that not knowing what my feedback would be. Not knowing if I would even trial or make this video. Um, I think that was really quite generous of them actually. So again if you guys do want to try the products. Then you can use my code NICOLA10. And that will give you 10% off. I absolutely will be repurchasing. Um, I'm really excited to see over the course of the next eight weeks or so if it does make any difference to my skin. Um, but also nails. It's too soon to tell just now nail wise. Um, obviously it's only been 10 days but it did say on the info packet that I read that over the course of eight weeks you should notice a difference. So that's what I'm going to do and I'm quite excited to see how that will go. If it will make a difference or not. So stay tuned, I will keep you guys updated. So anyway, I am going to now go do a reorder and enjoy my last sachet from this trial. And you guys can let me know what you think. Leave me a comment below if you've ever tried taking collagen supplements before. If you've seen any difference in your nails, hair, or skin, all that good stuff. Uh, I'm quite interested to see if anybody else has tried any products similar to this and if it worked. So please, if you have, leave me a comment below. Okay guys, that is it from me. Don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe. I post new videos every Monday and Friday. And if you want to see any more behind the scenes type things, you can follow me on Instagram at NicolaSavage22. Okay, everyone take care. I'll see you in the next one. Bye bye.